Hello everyone, I'm Stacy, and this is the For Bricks and Giggles YouTube channel. For today's build, I have a friend set. Set 42633 Hot Dog Food Truck from 2024. So let's get started. All right, so here we have the completed build. This set is 100 pieces according to the box and comes with two mini dolls. I have been loving all of the food truck builds Lego has done in the last five years or so, and so I was super excited to get this one. This is a four and up set, so it is very very simplistic, but one of the best parts is that there are no stickers in 4-up sets. I guess because small children wouldn't be able to apply them easily, and so any of the pattern pieces you see in this set are directly printed on the bricks and do not require stickers, and there are a few really great pattern pieces in this set. But before we deep dive into this set, I'll go ahead and show you the mini dolls first. So this set does come with two of the Friends mini dolls. First up we have Kaya. Someone needs to tell me because I definitely don't know, have we completely moved away from the rubber hair for the mini dolls. I have not opened a ton of friend sets. I do not own a ton of friend sets, but the more recent ones I've opened, none of them have had that classic rubbery mini doll hair. They've all had the traditional Lego hard plastic hair pieces, which I like a lot more. They feel more like traditional Lego, which anything you can do to make the friend sets feel like traditional Lego to me is an added bonus. I really like this hair piece. It's really pretty. I love the bright yellow yellow. It's a great color. She also has two different colors for her eyes, which I think is really cool. The only thing I'm truly concerned about is the fact that her hot dog is orange. Is this like a tofu dog or some sort of meat substitute? I don't know, but definitely a little concerning. <laughs> Otherwise, I think the rest of this mini doll is pretty cute. And then the other mini doll is Leo. His hair piece kind of reminds me of Emmett from the Lego movie with that little cowlick piece in the back there. <laughs> I think they're doing a much better job with the mini dolls, I'll be honest. I still would prefer regular minifigures, but I think in the last two or three years, the Friends line has gotten so much better. There have been so many sets I've actually wanted to get when in the past I kind of wanted nothing to do with Friends. So it only took around a decade, but I've finally come around to friend sets. But with all of that being said, two great mini dolls in this set. One more thing, I always tend to leave out the animals, so I don't want to forget to mention this little guy. Super cute little cat here. I like his orange spots and green eyes. And this is a relatively new pattern, just found in sets between 2023 and 2024. In my opinion, you can't have too many animals, so the more variation and fun animals they make for all of the Lego themes, I think the better. Alright, as for the rest of this build, I love the color scheme. Lots of lime and coral colored pieces, and I think they really make this set pop. So for the little food truck itself, I think they did a really nice job of designing this. Obviously, it looks exactly like a hot dog, and to be able to do that without using any kind of intricate builds, I think is really impressive. So up top here is one of the patterned tile pieces I was talking about. If you're not a friends collector, but still wanted to build your own hot dog truck, or a little hot dog restaurant of some sort, this would be a great piece to get on Bricklink just to buy individually to create your own mock. I can't imagine that piece would be super expensive to get since this is an incredibly rare or expensive set. And while you're at it, I would highly recommend this menu piece as well. Definitely another great pattern piece there. Got a little cash register there. I don't know if this is where they're heating up the hot dogs or storing them in a little fridge here and then heating them up on the pan probably would be my best guess, but there's actually quite a bit of space in there. You could add more stuff to the interior if you wanted to. Not necessary, but definitely more space there if you wanted to add some more little mocks on the interior. Then there are a few little additional builds with this set. We've got some hot dogs here, ketchup and mustard bottles. Super simple, but that's the kind of build I enjoy. I've always loved the four up sets because they feel like classic Lego to me or older Lego sets where everything wasn't super intricate. So stylistically my favorite type of set. You also have this little drink station, which is adorable. I love the translucent orange and pink pieces to indicate beverages. Feels like fruit punch or something like that. Again, really cute and fun and contrasts well with the lime green table. You also get a classic $100 bill. Hopefully that buys you a a lot of hot dogs, otherwise those are some very expensive hot dogs. <laughs> you also get a couple of little chairs to sit outside and enjoy your hot dogs. I also love that they give you a black hot dog, which is actually pictured with the cat, so I guess the cat gets the burnt hot dog, unless this is some sort of delicacy I am unaware of. <laughs> 
So like I said, 100 pieces, a super quick build, but tons of playability. This set is currently on the market. It's a fairly recent release, and the original price is $20 in the US. I would say for a 100 piece set, that's definitely on the more expensive side. It is a great fun build. I could definitely see myself having tons of fun with the set when I was a kid, but again, $20 for 100 pieces seems a bit high. Lego original themes, I think, are more likely to go on sale, so it's possible this set could be cheaper in the future. So if it were me, I would probably give it a little bit of time and see if it came down in price. But if money is no object and you think this is a cute set, then I highly recommend it. Watching. If you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe. And if you're interested in extra videos and content, check out the membership program starting at only 99 cents a month. There are already over 45 episodes available. See you all next time.